Santa Barbara. It's really beautiful. We already had the chance yesterday to stroll around. We did not pick up the camera for that. We just enjoyed the place and it's really beautiful. You can see on all those housings uh, the influence from the Portuguese people came here around about the 15th or 16th century, I think, and they discovered that place and it's really beautiful. So they don't call it uh, with the wrong reason the Riviera of the West Coast because it's really nice here the weather is nice and all the surroundings are nice and we're now just exploring the city showing you guys a little bit of the city showing you some amazing Instagram spots for sure like we always do and try maybe not the hiking ones because we're just here for two days and we're not doing the big hikes up to the mountain where you can see all of the city from above but we're showing you the city by itself we're showing you the chroma gate I think it is and we're showing you one of our favorite beaches at the evening we found yesterday evening it was super beautiful but we show you that later and now we just take you guys with us to the next spot let's see what we find So Santa Barbara just started growing after the gold rush around the 19th century. It just growing growing a lot and very or a lot too fast for this size. And so the government limited the people living here in Santa Barbara to 85,000 in 1975. So the people became very fast, very big and then they stopped it. That uh, kept on till 1995 and today we have um, around about 92,000 people here in Santa Barbara and it's still a little bit more a tiny place but for that it's very very calm and very nice The most cutest rolled eyes we could find here at the restaurant, just right over the corner. Yeah. And yeah, Santa Barbara is very well known for good food. Yeah, they have beautiful restaurants and cafes and yeah. And all the stuff because they have a big influence from the Spanish side, so you get a lot of good tacos and stuff. Don't dare you, you start before I have, can put down the camera. <laughs> no, you really will find really, really a lot of food and good food. We will try some later because we need something real to eat instead of that. <laughs> but for now, we just try that and see what we can find later. Put away the camera. Pitbull, Chihuahua, Georgia, Chihuahua. Oh, I love him. Gordo. Yeah. <laughs> so, so cool. Have a great day, buddy. So, this guy was amazing. His dog's just chilling. We saw him earlier that day. Um, just super, super awesome. So, what we have here is um, the Santa Barbara, I always want to say Santa Cruz, <laughs> the Santa Barbara Art Gallery that's happening every Sunday here. Um, I asked to film but they're not super into I understand because I film those photographs and those pictures that's fine but if you're into art come here on Sunday it's super super cool to watch every Sunday here at the beach east from the pier we're going now to the chromatic gate chroma gate however you want to call it and um, it's around about one mile to walk uh, you can rent a bike or something like that, but we're just in time. A little yeah, walk. Yeah, and we, we are a little bit in a hurry because of the clouds there. Oh yeah, really? <laughs> Look at that. You can see down there, the clouds are coming into the bay. And the fun actually is, Claudia? It's like in Morro Bay. Morro Bay, the yeah. Same. We, yeah. We, you could see it. It's some kind of... Maybe it's just happening here at the ocean. And this morning, we just saw it, yeah? We, we're staying somewhere around over there in a motel and I said to you we don't have good weather today yeah and the weather <laughs> forecast always said yeah, it's sunny it's sunny and I was blaming her they why don't they do the right weather and we drove here super nice but now we can see the clouds are coming in so we're rushing to the chroma gate and have a look if it's nice and maybe come back later this day to take a 
good picture with good light, but we want to show you what we're talking about. Is this yours? Yeah, mine was the water. How much is the water? Donate two dollars. Two dollars? Yeah. We go for that. Cool. Yeah. Oh, you're too kind. Thank you so much, sir. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Guys, so we arrived at our first stop, the chromatic gate, right there. Claudia already tried to shoot some pictures, but it's maybe not the best time to be here. Yeah. So, I think I will snip you guys to a later point, uh, when we come back, when the sun is a little bit further down. And then we can take some beautiful shots here, and i show you this place in a better light. So. We jump now in the future. Ready guys? So, in three, two, one. Whoa! So, we jumped from over there to here in time. I'm new in that time jumping business. So, I think it's pretty good. And we have now, we are half past six. And the sun is now way, way more beautiful. Look at this. We already got some other Instagrammers here. But the sun is around about there. And you get the beautiful light and you can stand right there and you get this lovely, lovely light tunnel to shoot the picture here. So, that's what we're gonna do now. Shoot a lovely picture with this beautiful lady and this handsome guy. <laughs> and let's have a look how beautiful this picture comes out. How did this work? Good Instagram spot? Yeah. Yeah. You maybe will get one or two shots here. So don't expect to get a ton for that. Uh, just the city is way more better. Blah, better. But it's super fun to shoot here. So we had our fun. We shot a blast of photos. I recommend come here so at five or half past five and then you will get some awesome shots. So. And? We also did a couple pictures. Yeah, that is not happening that often. <laughs> you want to be on video? Like and subscribe! Like and subscribe! <laughs> <laughs> Some of your friends. And after that delicious meal, I decorated myself a little bit more beautiful. And Claudia had a good cocktail, isn't it, Claudia? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we come to a next place, or it's not even a place, it's just a state road or the side roads of Santa Barbara. Super beautiful to shoot. And uh, now we have, yeah, half past four, half past five, uh, half past four and the shadows are starting to drop and that's the time when you want to come here and enjoy this beautiful neighborhood and taking some shots here of those spanish portuguese houses and the neighborhood here is really beautiful and you can do some nice uh, summery street style shots what we're doing now so let's go take some pictures So, we were just rushing here and we were talking and I would say this place here from 4 p.m. on is Instagram gold, I would say. Um, if you're just here for one day and you want to get as much as possible out of your time, plan around about an hour or something like that for here because you will do a lot of bangers here. The light is beautiful, the plants are beautiful, the houses are beautiful, you have beautiful cars. And here's not much traffic. That's the best you can go on the road. Be careful. I don't recommend shooting on the road, <laughs> but you can do nice stuff here. And actually, even the motels down here are beautiful. When you just want look here, that's a motel. And it really looks awesome. It's just beautiful. And it's just one road beside the main road to the beach. So there's the beach. Hand away, focus. There's the beach. 
and the road was just this one over there. I will uh, link down the name of the road and maybe some coordinates that you can find it on Google when you come here, come here, shoot. But be respectful, of course, to the owners of the houses and don't go on the land and do stuff like that. But that's really, really beautiful. made it to the last spot? We made it. We made it. Butterfly Beach guys. This is super beautiful. Especially when it's sunset. Can you see that? It is epic down here. You can get so many beautiful shots. We've been here yesterday evening to blue hours. So when the sun already has set, it is just amazing. Don't stay there in the front at the pier. Come here to Butterfly Beach. It's with a car. I think, how long is it? Um, five, seven min minutes? Yeah, something like that. And it's really worth coming here. There are way less people, so here are now, what is 20 people or something. The beach is beautiful, the sun is super epic, and you will get some awesome, awesome pictures here. Yeah, so we go a little bit further, and then have some shots, and maybe get up the road. Let's see. Hope you enjoyed our little video about Santa Barbara. Hope you enjoyed our tips we could give you. Even if we haven't been here so long, we really enjoyed it. And if you have any questions, just let us know down in the comment box. And if you're interested in upcoming videos, make sure to subscribe, turn on post notifications, and see you guys in the next one. Bye! Bye.